That's the Cybrook, and you can't count them out. The past two years, they've been in the top running for the German Bundesliga. Outside. Yeah. Three straight. Q ops for the pen hold. Quite the clean serve, but. Francisco some issues. And an answer. Authority. It's the deficit. Number two. Squared up. With that one pretty poorly off that bounce. Yeah, it won't be five in a row. for that back edge. Oh, no! oh, a bit fortunate off the netting there. That's three straight. Reach that one table across the body. Ball comes off setting up the serve. How is his defense? Two points to go. Full return. Power shot. Put him in nine. Call there. Up on the verge. Our opening set. Oh. 
tried to get a bit cheeky there. Just lofted over. Watched with authority. But unfortunately, just a bit shy of the corner. And that'll be the first set in the bag. Getting a word in now between the sets. Pretty darn close to getting the back edge. But the delayed Olympics that were 2020, taking place of course last year. Well, he's got the pedigree to back it up. Come back from a set or two down. I would have liked to got off to a... Does not go his way. Who gets the advantage early? That was a display of a bit of fortune and, of course, talent from Q there. Really had to hope that one didn't edge off, and it didn't. Expecting his racket. Or he just mistimed that a little bit. Like he may have caught the back of the table on that return. Played from the Snob representative. Oh, pushed very well. There was a poor angle. He comes back with aggression and power. Just the jump this time around. much behind that one. Just let that ricochet off his racket, to be fair. Neck and neck here in the second set. Now, he does not fall for Francisco. Oh, wonderful. No bounce. Tough to steer that one back over. Coming out strong. Francisco helped. The power shot worked earlier. It's failed him in the second set. Down five. Celebration for that point. And no cause for it. Give a misplay from Francisco. Not been an awkward angle. Second setup for grabs here. Francisco keeps it alive. On quite a run here. Get 
back in it. Two in a row, it's a good start. To extend this. Well, the power caught a cue off guard for just a moment, but well returned, and then Francisco looked a bit. Shocked isn't quite the word. You expect the caliber of these players in those. Just caught him going across the body a little too much. He went for placement on the backhand. Had that hit, Q probably would have had a difficult time uh, getting to it, that's for sure. As it stands, that's the second. Sixth ranked German. Solid start for Francesca. You can see how much that one means to come back now. Two sets down is still don't want to get into a hole. Hasn't been able to find those. Consistently, that is. There's been a few moments where Couple of nets. Fortunate bounce, or more fortunate, I should say. It seemed to just stop in its tracks. No blasting. I fake. It was going to go across the body and went. In the bag. Have his teammates want to see? Oh. Just seem to hang in the air for a moment back over. To level, third set picking up the heat. Francisco really had the upper hand for a few points there. Well done. Six a piece. See if someone can steal the momentum a bit here. along 
with here in the Champions League. Eighth in the bag. Seventh in the bag, rather. That one's a bit off. All points vital. See if someone can get the swing of things going. in a row Step to close. their first set of the afternoon a few mistakes by Q now set point on the table from Francisca One closer. Serve on Q's side as well. Let's see if we can replicate serving. A good start. Brings it to within one now. Couldn't quite get the back end of the table, and that'll be set number one, or the third set, rather, and the first for Sabrika. Back in that one, he looked all but over once he was down by three. Ultimately, it doesn't matter how you get him, as long as you do, and the final point. You name it, he's won it. And certainly as a head coach. Last year's Champions League winners. And that's just one of the stories. Can Borussia Dusseldorf get back to the finals? Two quick points to start it off here in the fourth set. Seems to have found some focus a bit. See if he can respond here. Not necessarily from his own doing. He'll take it however it comes. have to move across the table. Q looks focused. Plenty of power. Q gets number five. Sign of remorse there. Yeah. 
well to even get a paddle on it. Quick enough, too close to the chest, tough to direct that one. Back table side. Back to within one. Credit where it's due, Francisca is hung in there. Opening two sets did not go his way. Certainly our best rally so far in terms of movement. In the end, it ends with a slam. A recovery from Francisca to get that one back on the table after being in by, well, not quite a large margin, but a little bit. Even at five. And forth we go. Swing for Francisco now. Looking to knock this up at two sets of people. Who has other ideas? Tightly contested. Fourth set on the table. Strike of his career, 41st in the world. That don't count out. Both of them German, of course, but Patrick Francisca himself the highest ranking of 16th. Granted, that was a few months ago. The quality that the... Costly error there. Squared at nine. Two to go. And that's we both find 10, of course. Up by two. Twelve, fourteen, so on. Twenty off the net. And the unfavorable bounce for Francisco who now stares down match point, as does Q, but it's on his side of the table. Francisco to serve. Ooh, went for power. Tried to finish it off with style. Very close to finding it. Advantage must be found. Two. 
Had the space to convert as well. Q coming up with a little more aggression now. It's played a bit reactionary at times. And to get on the front foot here. So you can secure a third set. Can Francisca extend this? Indeed he does. He's still need to find that two-point margin to seal this one up. This is certainly an aggressive side there. Extend this back and forth affair for yet another two. Yeah! No, we won't. Two apiece as we head to our fifth set. Opening two went the way of Borussia. To favor. That should build some confidence. Follows up the somewhat slow start with a smash. has been around as the coach of Borussia for quite a while, since 2010. He was also one of their pro players from 2003 to 2007. It doesn't get much better as a, as a coach in your first year to win the Champions League, win the German Championship, and the German Cup. Of course, in 2010 when he started. Granted, it took a little while to replicate that same dominance of success. In 2018, Borussia did the same thing, winning all three of those major competitions that they find themselves in. But with 20 titles to his name, 12 years, it's hard to argue with the level of success that he has enjoyed. So hunting for their fourth Champions League final. A well, victory, that is. Thank you. Starts it off well. If the last two sets are anything to take away from and move towards this one, you might be looking at another close back and forth affair. Which, of course, for viewing purposes, is fantastic. As a player, on the other hand, not much more stressful than that. Big stage. Take a pump. earlier with the pen holder styles you can see and 
is actually the player to adopt that style of play. two have met before. Back in 2013, I believe. Or 2019, rather. Domestically, they also square off in terms of a big major tournament. It's 2019 at the German Open. That's the finals on that occasion. Well delivered. Cuts it down to two. To come up. Six in for Q. And a strong finish. Plenty of emotion on the court. Thank you coming away with a demonstrative point. Francisca again. Failing to find the back edge of the table. Wonderful duel between the two. Nice to see things go down to the wire. Granted, Francisca could have had another point or two, and we would have had an even closer finish. As we get set for our next duel on the table, we get a few moments to sit back and not relax necessarily. But look forward to the next matchup. <laughs> 